every day tons and tons and tons hundreds of tons probably nationwide are being uh, being thrown straight into landfill uh, this is this is unnecessary and in fact it really is a waste because as we've shown this this is a resource we collect it on a bicycle with a trailer uh, in town and then we take it out here to our unit and uh, process the coffee and then we plant it with uh, the mushroom which is what we call the spawn. We leave that for a month in conditions that are similar to what you would find underground uh, so that's warm and dry and uh, dark. Mushrooms are essentially nature's recyclers in, uh, in the outdoors. They break down organisms and matter and turn it back into nutrients for uh, other organisms to use. So in that sense, it's breaking down the coffee and then using it as a food for which to grow food for us. Well, a lot of people ask, do they taste of coffee? Do they contain caffeine? Um, the fact is, um, the, the growing medium of the mushrooms does affect the flavour, and also the freshness that you get when you grow your own mushrooms at home really gives it something that you just can't buy from the shops. So the leftover coffee grinds. Really? That's fantastic. We're taking something that people regard as waste and by making it really easy to use to grow mushrooms with and, and to bring uh, to life you know, the, the process of where food comes from, it's really making people see waste in a different way.